All right, next we're going to talk about doing sorts on your report. So any report can be sorted by as many fields as you wanted to. And it's actually not too difficult to sort your report. You're going to use this icon over here, the record sort expert. Now, if you don't have the icons or if you can't find your toolbars, then uh, we're going to pick on report. And then we have the record sort expert. And notice how it's the same icon. And it's, it's really the same thing, of course. So let's go into that. Okay, now um, you can sort by as many fields as you wanted to. In this case, let's, let's say we want to sort first by country, and then by expense type, and then by U.S. dollar amount. So I'm going to double click on country, and then expense type, and then the U.S. dollar amount. And you can see all those fields are over here. You can even use fields that are not on the report. These are the fields that are currently on the report, but if I scroll down, then these are all the other fields that are available in that table. We can sort by any field, uh, even if they're not on the table. All right. Now, uh, even if they're not on the report, I mean. So notice how we have the country, the expense type, and the U.S. dollar amount. By the way, we can we can use more than three. Uh, let, let's let's go with uh, the date. You can really have as many as you wanted to. Uh, I once tried to sort a report by 15 fields, and it let me do that, and it, it would have gone even further than that. So uh, I'm sure it, it'll meet uh, your needs as far as the number of fields that it allows. I'm, a, I'm actually going to, uh, well, we can leave the date on there. It's not going to make too much of a difference. So you can see I have country, and then expense type, and then U.S. dollar amount, and then the date. Now you see these A's over here? that's either ascending or descending. So let's say I want the U.S. dollar amounts to be descending. We're just going to pick on that, and then we pick on descending over here. Notice how it changes that to a D, but just for that one field. So I think this screen is fairly intuitive to use. You can pick as many sort fields as you wanted to over here. Each, each field can be either sorted ascending or descending just by picking on the fields and using ascending or descending over there. And now the sort order is going to be the top-down priority. So this report is going to sort first by country, and then by expense type, and then by U.S. dollar amount, and then by the date. All right. So if you want to change the sort order, watch what I'm going to do. I'm going to pick on one of the fields, and then use these arrows to move it up or down. So I'm going to click on that up arrow, and then again, and then again. So now it'll actually sort by date first, and then by country, and then by expense type, and then by U.S. dollar amount. So the top-down priority is the sort order. To change the sort order, you're just going to pick on one of those, and then move it up or down accordingly using these arrows. So let's go back to where it's sorted by the country, and then the expense type, and then the U.S. dollar amount, and then the date. We're going to click on OK. Uh, now here's the sort right over here, record sort expert. So notice how all of the Austrias are together. Within Austria, notice how all of the dinners are together, all of the hotel items are together, and then the incidentals. And then let's say within the incidentals, you have the higher amounts going down because we made that one descending. And you can see the whole report will be sorted like that. So here, uh, all the Frances are together, and then within France, all the breakfasts are together, and then within breakfast, you have the higher amounts going down because we made that descending, and you can see the sort work perfectly. Uh, so let's try it again. Let's go into the sort expert. Let's say I want the expense type to be first. So I'll pick an expense type and move it up with these arrows. Now it's going to do it by expense type, and then by country, and then by U.S. dollar amount, and, by, and then by the date. Let's click on OK. And just like that, the report just uh, sorted in a different way. Now all of the breakfast items are together. Within the breakfast items, all the Italy's are together. And within Italy, we have the higher amounts going down, because we sorted that one descending. So that's how you're going to sort the report using the record sort expert.